Brother Mago made some good points, Langer said. We can't save everyone. But that doesn't mean we can't try. Sometimes a useful delusion is better than a useless truth. Who told you the Negro deserved a place of refuge? Who told you that you had that right? Every minute of your life's suffering has argued otherwise. Tell me about this thing you were playing with, fantasy, reality, and the larger thing that the combination of those two things seems to have created in this book. A straightforward historical novel would follow someone running north, but then I couldn't examine different parts of history, put them in conversation with each other and move things around and make the story about race and America and different kinds of oppression. So I won't stick to the facts, but I'll stick to the truth, a larger American truth that escapes uh, what actually happened. What kind of research did you do? Did you spend a lot of time in the South doing it? I don't like to leave the house. Uh, <laughs> when you go outside, there's like too many people, I guess you call them. Uh, <laughs> a lot of the primary texts I use are slave narratives. Frederick Douglass, Harriet Jacobs, sort of the famous ones. In the 1930s, the U.S. government, Works Progress Administration, putting people back to work, hired writers to interview former slaves, people in their 60s and 70s, who had been kids at the time of the Civil War, and got their life stories. Slavery was brutal, and you captured in a way that's, um, that for me actually was more powerful than films I've seen. Slave narratives, they'll describe the most atrocious thing in that, with a brick face, the most matter-of-fact tone. You know, then my mother was beaten to death, period, and the next day I started, for the I started working in the fields for the first time. And those two sentences, just two sentences, if your life is violence and brutality and you, you're telling someone about it, you don't dramatize it, you just, it's just a fact. What was the playlist for writing this book? It goes from like Public Enemy to The Clash to Ella Fitzgerald to The Misfits. I sing along, have dance parties. It's all part of the process. Mm -hmm.